Maldives is reeling under a political crisis as we speak. The military has taken over the country's parliament in order to stop impeachment efforts of the president. Maldives' political situation worsens as military takes over parliament house and MPs preventing, prevent it from entering the compound. Police attacked MPs with pepper spray and two MPs, uh, we, have been to we have been told, have been arrested as well. Army is inside the parliament. Let me go across to my colleague Madhav who joins us live on this big story. Madhav, so clearly uh, it's a political crisis once again that we are seeing in Maldives. Can you explain to us what exactly is happening as we speak? Well, uh, you know, it is the island nation of Maldives that's once again, you know, after the coup that took place about five years ago, once again in throes of a crisis. Last time around as well, if you remember, when uh, the democratically elected government of President Nasheed at that point of time was overthrown, at that point of time as well, it was the army that was in fact used to storm all uh, you know public offices such as the public broadcaster that of the assembly that of the president's office this time round as well it's a similar sort of move that has taken place it's the majlis which is really the parliament of uh, maldives that has once again been stormed army commandos uh, have all gotten into that particular area clearly of course uh, uh, this has come a bang on the move right after the move that was taking place to impeach uh, the existing president of maldives so clearly of course uh, for India, this is a move that has huge implications. Not, is, not only is Maldives right next to India at a very strategic location in the Indian Ocean, but also the fact that there have been uh, Islamist groups, jihadist groups that have been gaining strength and have been trying to build up a base there in Maldives, as well as, of course, China, which has also been trying to woo uh, uh, the government over there and uh, uh, set up bases over there. For India, there are a number of strategic reasons why a peaceful Maldives is extremely important. But this uh, uh, sort of move domestically uh, is bound to have its own repercussions. There have uh, of course globally been a lot of comments that have been made about uh, the tendency of the current regime over there to use strong arm tactics to try and crush democracy. And we must remember it was a move for democracy that actually brought in the past regime that has not been able to come back to power uh, in uh, the country of Maldives. So one will really have to see the kind of falling out of this particular uh, event that has taken place today because uh, in any case, uh, you know, sending uh, the army into any particular uh, a democratic institution such as a parliament or a lawmaking yes. body such as this is certainly a move that is bound to raise huge amount of eyebrows globally.